What do you make of the relationship between the United States and China? Um, we're in a Cold War. Let's not pretend we're not. Uh, China is continuing its robust um, whole of government, whole of nation activities against the United States, whether it's buying farmland next to sensitive military bases, opening Chinese uh, police stations inside the United States, uh, spy balloons going over sensitive military in uh, installations. Until the U.S. administration, the Biden administration gets serious and decides to impose costs on China for these activities, they're only going to become more brazen. But right now, it seems that the administration is more interested in some sort of strange, you know, climate deal with China, when in fact China is the number one polluter in the world, than it is in imposing costs on them. That's why there was a, a meeting between uh, Secretary of Energy Jennifer Granholm and the Chinese Communist Party this week, because it seems that the administration wants some sort of uh, pretend environmental deal rather than imposing real costs on China for what they're doing inside the United States. I'd like to add that 60,000 Americans a year die of fentanyl poisoning um, and drug poisoning. And these base chemicals are coming from China and across the U.S. southern border. But the administration just isn't serious about this sort of thing. And the Chinese administration, Beijing, is just all too happy to continue these malign activities.